this video, I'm going to be breaking down the best trips defense in college football 25. It's a very simple coverage, but it's going to literally stop the majority of things that people want to do out of trips tied in. Now, this coverage defense comes to us out of the 335 penny formation. If you want to get my entire 335 penny defensive ebook, it's available by becoming a member of our school community, school.com slash Cody Bauer. For just $10, you'll get access to all of our college and Madden offensive and defensive ebooks. Those ebooks also update throughout the years. So we're always keeping you up to date on the best way to play defense and offense in the game. That's where we get better at the game. If you guys want to join the school community, the link is going to be in the description. Now, what we're going to be doing here is we're going to be in the 335 penny uh, defense, and we are going to be in the cover two shell. So we're going to be in this cover two shell, and we're actually going to be calling the cover two coverage or Tampa two. So we're basing this out of the Tampa two. As you see, my user is going to be over here. We're just going to be able to just simply come over here like this. And the setup for the defense here is we are going to shift our defensive line to the left side of the screen. We're going to crash our defensive line outside. This is how we're going to send some pressure at the opponent. And then all we're going to do here is we are going to uh, create what I call a roll coverage. The way that you create a roll coverage is you're going to put your user on a hook curl to the right side of the screen. You're going to put the outside corner on a outside third. You're going to put the safety on a middle third. And then you're going to put the safety on the left side on this outside third. Now, the reason we're going to be rolling over that trip side, that's going to take away a lot of the stuff to the left. And then with our user, we're going to put this linebacker on the right on a purple or curl flat zone. And we're going to kind of user this right side. We're going to use this right side seam. And then if we need to, we can always switch stick over to that left side hook curl. So you see like a play like verticals, for example, where they put the running back on a Texas pattern. We're just gonna be able to climb here, kind of work to here, and they're not gonna really be able to throw that crosser because we have that third coming over the top. Another thing that's really good about this coverage is the fact that you do have a really nice four man uh, pressure that has potential to come in if they don't block a running back. So they're gonna have to block and this is one of my favorite, favorite defenses. Now, actually, really underrated, I love this seam flat adjustment. One of the main routes this year that people are utilizing to their tight end is they're utilizing the stemmed corners. Well, this seam flat adjustment is going to do a really good job of defending, as you see right there, going to do a really good job of defending that kind of tight end corner route that gives this defense so much trouble. Now, another way that I like to run this coverage shell that I will occasionally do this adjustment, um, this one's a little bit more advanced, but basically what we're gonna do is we are going to put the left side outside safety here. We're gonna be putting him on a outside third to the left. We're gonna put the right side safety on an outside third to the right, which leaves obviously as you see the middle of the field. So the way that we're gonna defend the middle of the field here is we are gonna put this nickel corner in a middle third. Now, the big thing with this adjustment is the big vulnerability that you have defensively is going to be the left side seam, but it's a super tight window. So what we're gonna do as a user is instead of putting our user on a hook curl to the right side of the screen here, we're gonna put our user on a hook curl to the left side of the screen. All we have to do is move to the other side, put him on a hook curl, and then we're able to stand here. So where's the big hole in this coverage? It's really over those two receivers. So the snap of the ball, we're gonna run over here, and you see that this middle third will take away the slot throw seam. And so the main route or the main receiving threat that we need to be able to defend is going to be this left side inside trips receiver, which is on the majority of the back breaking routes in this formation. So what we need to do as a user is we need to instantly get over here, take this away, and then probably switch stick off of that hook curl on back onto that vert hook defender. So the way that you would do this practically is you would hook curl this guy before you move him over. You just move him over like this. You have these outside thirds that are gonna do a really good job of taking away those corners. They run something like verticals with, let's say, like a running back Texas pattern. And you're going to run over here, and then you're just going to switch stick down to this defender right here and allow you to be able to kind of use her in a safer, uh, a safer way. Another simple way that you can do this is you can actually man this guy up. This is kind of a little bit of an advanced tip, but you can man this guy up to that inside trips receiver, and you can kind of come over here like this. And at the snap of the ball, you're just going to immediately switch stick here and let that man coverage go guard that middle trips receiver. A couple really, really good ways to defend trips tied in. These are super good. Whenever you're defending trips this year, 
pretty much always want to be blitzing off of that left-hand side. Now, the reason why we're in this cover two shell is so that they cannot run anything to the right side with the quarterback zone being super good this year, the speed option uh, being, being there as well. You want to have something like the coverage that we're showing you. And again, all you have to do is just throw this guy on a curl flat and he will stop the majority of the corner routes. So here I'm actually going to throw just like a regular corner route and you'll see that this curl flat is going to be able to defend it super, super well. Thanks for watching the video. If you want to check out the rest of the 335 Penny defense or get better at the game in general, join our school community. 10 bucks gets you access to all of our college and Madden offensive and defensive ebooks. You can sign up by heading down to the description and clicking the link down below.